This video is sponsored by AnyRecover. Today, I'm going to delete all information from my hard drive. I have a lot of important information on it. After this process, I'm going to show you how to recover your data. And actually, it's possible. Stay tuned. My friends, as you can see, this is my hard drive. And now I'm going to connect it to my laptop. For this, I'm going to use this SATA adapter. Such a Tetris game, I'm going to connect SATA adapter to my hard drive. Whoop! So I successfully connect my hard drive to the SATA adapter. And finally, I'm going to connect my hard drive into the laptop. So gently install USB cable into the laptop. And what do we see here? Everything works. So fellas, we are in the Windows 10. If you click here, you may see external disk 3.0. If you click on this PC, you may see these three partitions. And actually, this is a single hard drive that I connect to my laptop. And local disk C, this is my main SSD drive. So what I'm going to do next, I'm going to close this window, then I'm going to press disk part, press enter. Literally, I'm going to delete all information from external hard drive. For this, I'm going to type next. List disk, press enter. Actually, disk 0 is my SSD drive and the second one is HDD drive that I connect to my laptop. I will type next. Select disk 1, press enter. Disk 1 is now the selected disk. I successfully select my hard drive. And the last command, clean. And what do we see here? Disk part succeed in cleaning the disk. That's mean I literally delete all information and all partitions. I format my hard drive. The most important in this situation is that I'm going to show you how to recover all your data. First of all, we need to open our browser. In my case, I will use Google Chrome browser. Click on it. Then you need to type next. Any recover and press enter. So actually, if you scroll down a little bit, here you may see link this website, anyrecover.com. Link will be in the video description. You need to click on it. My friends, we are on anyrecover.com. Actually, this is official website. Now we need to scroll down a little bit. And here you may see, try it now. You need to click on it and it will automatically download on your laptop or computer. As you can see, I successfully downloaded this software on my laptop. Now I will close this window. Then you need to go to the place where you save your software. In my case, I need to click on this PC and go to the downloads. Click on it and here you may see any recover. Now we need to install this software. Click on it, click install. Wait a few minutes. We successfully installed any recover on our computer and then we need to click start now. So folks, we are in the software, but before we start, we need to do one very important thing. We need to close the software, click on it, go to this PC, now you need to find this PC, click on the right mouse button, select manage. Here you need to select disk management. Actually, this is a very important moment because we will allocate our hard drive. Click OK. As you can see, this is unallocated space. We need to click on the right mouse button one more time and select new simple volume. Click next. It doesn't matter which letter you will choose next and finish and voila system can see hard drive without any problem now we can close this window in any recover window you need to click on this icon it will automatically search for a hard drive and it successfully found our hard drive so now you need to click on it so guys we are in the game this software literally trying to find all missing file in this case we just need to wait definitely it depends on how much space do you have and voila scan completed now you can click ok we have 
categories photos videos audio documents etc also here you have option to type for missing file if you know the name of the file for the example i will type back and see the result for back and you can see background after that you can click on the file and you can preview the photo click yes wait a few minutes after you check your photo you can click on recover then you can decide the place where you want to save your file for the example i will create the folder on a desktop folder select folder wait a few minutes congratulations we successfully recover our file so let's check is it for real new folder and voila we successfully recover our photo so you can use this tool to recover your files photos etc everything is very simple if you want to recover few files for example one two three you can just select recover and you will have opportunity to recover your files successfully recover our files and that's fine but if you want to recover all your files you need to click here and click on recover in this case you need to have license for month year or lifetime it all depend on you as you can see everything works and if you want to recover all your lost data you can use this program so guys if this video was useful for you please like it and if you want to know how to fix your broken hard drive i recommend to click here on this video